I love gorgeous people, I love to scrub, it's fun from Australia, yay! So super excited and super happy to be sharing this package with you all, woohoo! This um, gigantuous box here, as you guys can see, is my swap box from Linda. Thanks, Linda. Hi, Linda. Uh, Linda's YouTube channel is Live Out Now, and she's so super talented and just so super awesome and a wonderful friend also. So thank you so much, Linda, for sending your package my way, and um, I'm so glad and happy that you liked as well as um, enjoyed the projects that I have had so much fun made, making them for you. And, you know, it makes me smile that you really, you know, love and appreciate them as much as I've enjoyed making them for you. So, without saying too much more, it, the box um, was a bit battered and bruised in um, transit, as you guys can see there. So, I don't know um, what happened. It had a long way to come. Um, I received it over a week ago, but because I was super busy, like I mentioned, I didn't have any time to open it, but I had to sneak peek because I love... Linda's um, talent, Linda's creation, everything that Linda makes is just jaws dropping gorgeous and I had to sneak peek and while I was sneak peeking I found um, on top of the box this gorgeous altered letter that she had made for me and um, I took it out and I had a look at it and because it, it was kind of like shaky inside and I looked at it and through the train like through the transit or uh, while the box is on its way here some parts of um, the gorgeous altered letter got uh, damaged so I had to glue that back with a really strong glue so I put the box down and I share with you guys the first project that um, I had taken out of the box that Linda had made for me and here it is it's so super gorgeous let me try and zoom in so that you guys can see a lot better Sorry about that guys, I had to change the angle as well as um, make my tripod shorter because uh, the lighting wasn't as great as I would have liked it to be. So here we have the gorgeous, gorgeous, amazing project that, um, that I have taken out of the box, like the first thing that I have taken out of the box and it's breathtaking. Can you guys believe how beautiful that is? You know, to get this all in frame is just so, so difficult. Oh, as you guys can see there. So I'm not sure if that's the front or this is the front, but it's also super amazing, Linda. I love it. I love it. I love it so much. And your talent is, oh my God, jaws dropping gorgeous. I just cannot believe how beautiful, how talented and oh, it's just how, how absolutely shabby chic this is. She has done some masking or some stenciling. Um, and she's doing, she's done some distressing and a bit of um, brick mask in there also. Laces in there and she's painted it and um, she's distressed it, the edges with I think like a dark black pen there, I'm not sure. Um, oh, I'm just so speechless. It is absolutely gorgeous Linda. So, so beautiful. So what came, what came off in the mail was um, this letter. I like this word, it says believe. Um, and this metal key here, I had to glue all this back as well as this particular cherub here. The cherub came off also and um, I glued it back and it was a new glue that I had to, that I was playing with. Um, I can't remember what it's called exactly but it kind of like bubbled on me. I didn't really like the glue uh, but it's a really strong adhesive glue and I didn't mind the yellow because it's got a bit of yellow everywhere also so it kind of like blended in so... Somehow I probably will have to try and stick little flowers in between here so I can hide the glue as you guys can see there But it's like a bonds leather metal ceramic and stuff like that That's why I purchased it because it needed to be really strong because these cherubs were really really heavy and um, it, it fell off um, Fell off here. It was in in the center here. So I messaged Linda and I wasn't sure where they went so message um Linda was so happy, uh, so kind enough to uh, send me pictures of what it looked like. So thank you so much, Linda. Look at all the beautiful embellishments that she has displayed here. Let me see. Okay, here's a beautiful close-up of um, the arrangements and the beautiful key. And look at the beautiful dangles on there. This is so me. It's so beautiful. Look at the gorgeous cherubs on there. How can you pass up these cherubs? But I'm so glad you did because they are so absolutely beautiful. And look at this little metal, not metal, little um, glass bottle. And I loved how she embellished it also with these beautiful little um, spaces in there um, on here. Don't mind my fingers, they're all tattered. 
and beautiful cameo. I'm just speechless. It's so hot here today and I just don't know what to do. I've just been Christmas shopping also and I come back and I'm so super excited to be sharing this with you guys. Look at how gorgeous that is. So magnificent. So beautiful Linda. And I think this is a dragonfly that she has somehow made out of um, some wire and a um, like a metal filigree there going across here and then she's stuck these um, I think these are purchased from um, Annie from Miss Garden Grove because I got some from her also and look at that is that from Annie Miss Garden Grove too that is just so beautiful Linda and she put a little um, pearl bling in the center and some flowers and these are gorgeous gorgeous I'm not sure if they're iron roses or walk because they're very very similar I was going to say I confused myself, but yes, Iron Roses or Walk. I'm not sure which ones they are. And oh, I just love the dangle on here, Linda. So, so super talented. So, oh, so super amazing. I've just like been playing with this for the, for the last couple of minutes because uh, I didn't want to, you know, drool over it anymore. So, thank you so much, Linda. Okay, in random order, I'm going to share with you guys the other project that's on top of the box that Linda has made for me also, or altered. I love the letter V that she has altered for me here. It's just so beautiful. And this is the other item that Linda has altered for me. Oh, so pretty, Linda. I don't know what to do. It's been a while since I've received Happy Mouth or package of any kind and oh I'm so looking forward to this package from you so super happy and super excited at the same time because I know I'm just gonna love it so much oh my god oh my god oh my god oh my god Linda oh my god <laughs> oh my god look at this I don't know what's in there but I can see a lot of dangly little bits and pieces inside I'm not sure if that's how they are meant to be but we'll see look at the embellishments on this can you guys see any better at all how beautiful that is she ordered for me a beautiful beautiful bird cage all shabby chic and um it's so super amazing and it's actually a pin cushion also look at that oh wow i would have never thought of doing such a thing with a um with a bird cage, it's so super amazing you can find a bird cage of this size. They have huge ones here only in Australia, and this is so beautiful. I've seen other people altering bird cages and send them as gifts to others, and I'm always so envious of that. But I've all finally got my own. It's from Linda. So there's the beautiful flowers and embellishments that she has used. And look at this on this side. Oh, I love, love, love the cameo, Linda so so beautiful and look at the little tassels and this lace that is gorgeous i love cotton crochet lace and mm, that is beautiful look at this just magnificent just so beautiful linda and look at all the gorgeous stick pins so pretty there's so many it's, they're all so beautiful i'm not going to take each and individual one of them out but they are just so super amazing so let's have a look see what's inside wow Wow, 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 wow. She's dangled a beautiful little charm. That is a gorgeous charm, Linda. So, so beautiful. It's very similar to the other cakes. So let's have a look at what's in here. Oh, it's a little birdie on it. <laughs> it's like a little birdie on a nest. Look at the gorgeous little birdie. Oh, that's so pretty. So pretty, Linda. I'm not sure where these two little hearts came from. PM me and let me know but I've got two little loose hearts in here are they meant to be like eggs that she's sitting on I don't know but they just come off they look like that Linda are they meant to be eggs I'm not sure but let's just put them as eggs down here for the meantime oh it's so stinky cute Linda I love it so much thank you thank you thank you so little birdie and her two love heart eggs for now we'll be going back down the bottom there again oh Look at that, she's down there. Oh, so super amazing. So beautiful, Linda. Thank you so much. A pink cushion um, on top of the birdcage, as you guys can see there. Isn't Linda just so super amazing and talented? Ooh. Little bee just slide off there. Glue that back in a minute. Pop that back there. 
So pretty Linda, love her, love her so much. So I better hurry up before I take like 10 minutes just filming one thing. Oh, I love it. So pretty. Okay, other items that's in the box. She packaged a lot of items in this box here in brown paper bag as well as those um, vintage paper bags. So let's open this box up. Some goodies from Linda. Oh, gorgeous Linda. She's got me some um, words. I uh, love word that says love. I love word that says love. God, I'm I'm a bit I'm losing it a bit today, and I so pretty. And this is gorgeous. Look at that. I've seen um, Lineka have one of these, and I was drooling, drooling, drooling over it. It's like a charm that you can put your picture in there. <gasps> I'm so going to use this on my um, Ice Princess mini album. It's perfect. It's so pretty. Thank you so much, Linda. I love it so much. In random order. <gasps> Ooh, Linda. You know I love doilies and crochets and... <gasps> Oh my goodness, I have something similar I think like this and it's in my hauled fold. So now I can use it. <laughs> it's so pretty. Look at this, it's so pretty Linda. Thank you so much for sharing this with me. Look at all these beautiful, beautiful doilies and crochets. Look at this. So super amazing. I love this kind of thing and Linda knows me really, really well. She's been watching my channel. Thank you, Linda. Oh, I love it. There's so much of all these gorgeous little panels. I'm going to treasure that. It's so beautiful, Linda. Thank you. Mother goodies. <gasps> Some gorgeous laces. Oh, wow, Linda. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. <laughs> So beautiful. Look at this gorgeous applique. Did you get this off like a wedding dress or something? Look at how beautiful that is. Oh, I love it, Linda. I'm going to say wow. I'm going to say Linda. I'm going to say thank you a thousand times. <gasps> Look at this wide eyelash lace. It's so beautiful. Oh, super amazing. I love tea dyeing, so I might tea dye like half of it. And then leave one half just as it is white because I reckon it's so beautiful. And she sent me some appliques also. How gorgeous are they? Simply, simply gorgeous. Thank you so much, Linda. I love them so much. They're so beautiful. And look at this. These are like vintage laces. So pretty. Thank you so much, Linda. Love, 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 love them. Oh, super amazing. Next little bag. So we have some um, normal paper bags and we have some of these that I can recycle. Because I, if you guys remember the mini album that I made for Linda, I just slipped one of these in half. And Sorry about that guys, I ran out of memory so I had to um, reload again back to this little package here. Linda shared me some gorgeous laces. Thank you so much Linda. Oh, we have some gorgeous, gorgeous white lace really really pretty and then we have some pink and white ones oh i love this one i have some items that are very similar to this one but not exactly the same can you guys see that it's like a light baby pink the lighting is not that great right now it's really bright now and there's this one here also wow 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 so pretty linda and these cute little dainty ones that's in a cream color and some white nylon ones, really, really pretty. And some cream eyelet lace, so super gorgeous, Linda. Thank you for sharing some laces with me. Pop these back so I'm, I can make some room for the other goodies. Ooh, this box is heavy, and I love that. I think she stamped that and cut that out and popped that on there. Isn't that gorgeous? It's got a little vintage lady on there. Oh, here's some jingle and jangle. It's some beautiful trinkets and charms from Linda. <gasps> oh, thank you so much, Linda. Oh, wow. And they're so pretty. So pretty, Linda. Look at that little one. Let me zoom in. 
Can you guys see that? Little um, heart with a cherub's face on there. And I've got some more little cherubs there also. And I've got, she sent me another of those um, porcelain or ceramic birdies. So pretty. And look at these. They're on little pins. Did you stick these on these little pins, clothes pins? Oh, they're so adorable, Linda. Thank you so much. Another little cherub. And then look at all these beautiful, amazing, super gorgeous metal embellishments. There's those. And I saw these peacocks everywhere that Linda has sent and I'm drooling over them. So pretty. <coughs> Excuse me. And there's these ones. Linda has like the best trinkets and whatnot, some metal embellishments. Wow, super amazing Linda. Thank you so much. I don't have any of these in this size, but I love, love, love these. I have them in like in a super gorgeous large size but nothing of these size thank you linda you shared so much with me too and there's a couple of these um i don't know what color you call these antique no it's not antique i can't remember the name but when i think about it it will come back to me love love these there's these two flower ones oh there's some more of those and these ones are so super amazing thank you so much linda love them more peacock Wow, wow. And some scissors. These are good quality scissors. Really nice and heavy. You guys can see that? The lighting is a lot better now, isn't it? And some of the other ones and another peacock. Yummy goodies from Linda. I've zoomed in a lot so you can't see those. So we've got some more goodies in this little bag. We've got um, cabajons. Um, I don't know if they're ceramic or I don't know porcelain type things. Really, really beautiful, aren't they gorgeous? And we have two cameos here also. Gorgeous gold cameo, and then we have this little cameo with a uh, dragonfly and some flowers. So pretty. Thank you so much, Linda. I'll pop all these back in the bag so I don't lose them. Thank you for sharing me with me all your treasures. Oh, I had to restock. I had to restock and you restock me. I'm running low in this because I send them out when I do my swaps and stuff. So thank you so much. Stock me up. Another bag with some more goodies. And in here we have some beautiful lace, lace fabric or some fabric of some sort. Let's have a look. Wow, so super gorgeous. It's got like uh, like a doily pattern. Isn't that pretty? Thank you so much, Linda. I love it so much. So beautiful. Can I fold that back? Linda knows I love fabric because I use um, fabric a lot in my projects. The next little bag is here. Let's see what Linda has sent. And this is quite heavy in here too. Oh, oh, so beautiful, Linda. This is the little um, heart thing that's on the um, the altered key. Look at these. The first time I seen these were on um, uh, Trisha's channel, a little shabby chic, where I think Laneka. Or was it Vicky? I'm not sure. Somebody has sent her some. Maybe Vicky. And I was drooling over them. They're so, so beautiful. Let me share with you guys the letter again. See, Linda's stuck one on there. So pretty. Thanks so much, Linda. Oh, these are so beautiful. I wish I, you know, I know how to make stuff like this. I'll make a ton of them. Thank you, Linda. I love them so much. They're so precious. I'll put them back there. Wow, a beautiful Christmas ornament. Oh, so pretty, Linda. That is so gorgeous. Wow. Look at that. I can hang that in my room. Oh, so pretty. Thank you, Linda. I love it so much. I've got to keep that protected. And she sent me some 
little jars that I could use for projects. Thank you. I only have like little round fat ones and these ones are a lot longer so thank you so much. I wouldn't even know where to purchase them because the other ones that I purchased was from my old hometown. And these are amazing. Thank you, Linda. It's another little bag with um, beads. Let's have a look. Wow. <laughs> so cute. Little beads there that I could use for stick pins. Thank you, Linda. I'll pop them back. So pretty. They can go in my charm collection. And look. The tiny, tiniest little stinky bag purse. And it opens up also. <gasps> wow. So cute, Linda. I love it. Thank you so much for sharing that with me. That is so super amazing. And I'm going to save that for a special project only. Oh, like another mini album like the one that I made for you. I have to make myself one one day. Wow, 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 wow. Linda, did you make these? <laughs> They're so beautiful. She sent me a ton of these ceramic, ceramic like or porcelain like flowers. Look, she sent me 10, 2, 4, 5, 9 of them. And there's some more in the other ones also. They're so pretty. Thank you so much. Don't mind my hands there. I went to the farm um, a couple of weeks ago and I got bitten by some bugs, I think. And it kind of like blistered and left me a mark now. So farm work can really really tarnish you so I didn't mention that in any of my vids but that's just what happened to my hand there it um at first it started itching like little itchy marks and then um this big one started to blister and when I went to the market I scraped it underneath the table and the blister popped and um it was really painful so I didn't want to go through too much detail in those ones so I've been through a lot on the farm <laughs> I had my good and my bad days, but you know, the farm is really rewarding and I enjoy it because I see my customers every weekend. So, even though I'm more tattered and bruised and you know, damaged from farm work, you know, I still, you know, enjoy it also. So, uh, let's go on to the next item. So beautiful, but just in case you go, guys are wondering, oh, why is Vast Hands so yucky? Yeah, I got stung by some um, creatures while picking snow peas. I don't know if I got stung or they sprayed some of their poisonous things on me, but it, it was just really itchy and it started swelling and wasn't good. Let's have a look. I see an altered bottle. Ugh. <laughs> that seemed like I'm strong enough to even open plastic. I've just been so super busy. The farm and the weekend trading on the weekend i went to um to trade or to sell at four markets so oh flat out today so tired oh linda my goodness wow i'm so glad that this, this didn't break in the mail look at this it is a beautiful gorgeous altered bottle a shabby chic style from linda my god linda it's so beautiful so pretty i love it so much oh my god <laughs> so beautiful linda i love all the flowers and the embellishments everything that you have incorporated on there and it's all matching to all the other items that linda has created so beautiful and so shabby chic linda i love it love it so much thank you so much oops let me pop that aside Oh, amazing, Linda. I can't, oh, I just can't describe how beautiful that is. Some more goodies from Linda. Oh, she shared some laces from Annie with me. Thank you so much, Linda. I seen these on Annie's channel and I was like drooling over them. And you sent them in one of my favorite colors, which is cream. Thank you, Linda. You're so wonderful. And some cream rosette trims also. So pretty. And some flesh colour creams. I love flesh. Love flesh so much. Wow. And this is like tooled netting but really, really soft. Linda sent me a lot of fabric which I really appreciate because these are the kind of things that I use a lot on my projects. So thank you so much, Linda. This is so beautiful. And this is so soft also. So 
I can't wait to incorporate this. It's so super amazing. I love using fabrics a lot in my projects, heaps and heaps. It's a, it just creates different textures um, and dimension to your projects. These are all wrapped up in Chrissy stuff, so I think these are all Christmas presents. Thank you so much. Should I put these underneath the Christmas tree until tomorrow? <laughs> I'll open them in the meantime anyways, because I've let the kids open the Christmas presents early anyways. Wow. Wow, Linda. Look at that. A beautiful little vintage box. Wow. Super amazing, Linda. It's so beautiful. And two little images of um, little girls there. And some more gorgeous yummies in here. So pretty. Thank you so much, Linda. It's a magnet that you can glue onto projects. Two cherubs. And one with a beautiful love heart. So gorgeous. Thank you so much, Linda. I'm going to pop them back in there again. I'm going to pop all the other ones back in there afterwards, just to keep it protected. Thank you so much, Linda. I love them. I love this little box. So precious. We have a round one this time. She wrapped it in this beautiful Christmas wrapping paper. Christmas came one day early for Val. Wow, love this box. Look at this gorgeous shabby chic box. Thank you so much, Linda. It's so shabby chic, so pretty. Wow, 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 wow. <laughs> I'm going to say a thousand times wow. This is my first ever mug that I've ever received. It's so pretty. It has a little tassel on it and it goes perfectly with the collection that Linda has put together for me. So shabby chic. My own personalised mug. Thank you so much, Linda. It's so beautiful. Now I have my own mug. Mug or cup. Whichever one you guys would like to call it. Next one. This is um, for Miss Bianca from Linda. So I'll give those to, to Bianca. To Miss Bianca from Linda also. Thank you so, so much, Linda. She's going to love you to death. She loves Prezzies. This one doesn't have Miss Bianca on it, so I'm sure we'll, we'll, we'll be able to open that one also. Wow, what's in these? What's in this bag? Let's have a look. Wow. Oh my goodness, Linda. Wow. Look at these. Oh. <laughs> they're so beautiful. They're brooches, but they're so vintage inspired. I love the colour, the mauve colour. So beautiful. Thank you, Linda. And a little heart charm that you can put a photo frame on. Thank you. Little tags, also Christmas tags or vintage tags. So beautiful. Thank you. Wow, I've never seen this before. This is plywood figures. Little ornate frames that you can add to projects. She sent me two of those. And a little birdcage one. So pretty. Thank you, Linda. Wow, and another brooch. Three gorgeous brooches, all sparkly. So pretty. Thank you, Linda. And some, uh, some Fleur de Lee. Beautiful Fleur de Lee um, stickers. Scrapbook Rama. It's some beautiful frames. That is gorgeous. I've never seen that colour before. Thank you so much, Linda. They're absolutely beautiful, beautiful. I love these. I just can't take my eyes off them. They're so sparkly. So beautiful. I'm still tired, so I hope you guys don't mind me rambling. It's just really tired, but I want to get this done. A 
here we have another gorgeous ultra project from Linda. Wow. <laughs> it's a beautiful, beautiful uh, collage, vintage collage. It's a hot vintage collage. Look at how beautiful is that. Oh, I'm out of focus. She used beautiful laces and this vintage image of a birdie. Oh, you collage it so well, Linda. It's all gorgeous. Thank you for sharing this. So super amazing. Love it. Love it so much, Linda. I'm going to wrap that back up again. So pretty. I think this is for anybody, so it must be for Var. We have a few more things to open before I share with you guys the mini album. I thought it's the blog that Linda has created for me. So we have here some wood frames. None of that's in English, so I'm not sure. But it's got Linda's name on it, I think. <laughs> but anyways, uh, paper picture frames. Wow. Great for altering. Thank you, Linda. Plywood figures also. These are great little ornaments that I could decorate for next year. So beautiful. Look at that. See how gorgeous they've altered that. Amazing, Linda. So pretty. And it says, uh, I can't even read the word up here, right? Um, cares? Cares mat? When you, when you kneel in your garden, cares mat. I can't read, but anyways, it's a beautiful, beautiful shabby chic wall hang. I can't read. Can you guys believe I can't even read that? Cares mat? No idea. If anybody knows, let me know. It's a beautiful wall hang, a shabby chic wall hang. Thank you so much, Linda. Love it. And the last package before before the um, the box and the mini. Wow. This is the vintage summer basic paper collection. <gasps> I actually forgotten about this, Linda. Oh, my goodness. Oh, you just jotted my memory. Thank you so much, Linda. I've spoken to Linda a long, long, long time ago before we even done our swap, I think, and I was looking for this paper collection. Oh, thank you so much, Linda. Oh, so super amazing. This paper collection is so beautiful. I've seen a lot of um, people on the Magnolia blogs use this paper collection. So pretty. Thank you, Linda. And, oh my god, this is the Vintage Summer Basics in the 12 by 12 is that right? Wow, <laughs> you're amazing Linda, thank you so much. Oh, this is the Vintage Summer Basics in the 12 by 12 wow, let me zoom out. 